Okay, family, so we getting, how many pounds was that? That's good enough. We getting the girls more uh, organic uh, food. So today we doing those, and we are doing these here. It's cheaper to get them out of these containers than it is to buy the uh, bags. And this is the reason why our uh, hens laid eggs a month and a half early. Okay, so with the pumpkin seeds that we use, we use the ones in the bag because, oh, they do get them. Well, we was using the ones in the bag, but... These here are $7.49 a pound, and I think the bag is $8.99 or $7.99 a pound. Do not get roasted and salted. It has to be raw. Raw pumpkin seeds. They love those. And as far as sunflower seeds, they love those, but I normally get the big um, raw bag of them for $8.99, but they have these $3.99 per pound. So I might get those. Nope, I won't. It says organic, roasted, no salt. And the hoof been peeled. So I don't want that one. I need this one. The organic, raw, um, hulled sunflower seeds. These. So I'm going to compare the price of the bag. Because I know the bag is one or two pounds for $8.99. But if it's cheaper, I will be back at this one. Okay, they moving everything around. So we got 24 ounces for $5.99. And then they got the raw pumpkin seeds. These normally be in the front. So, last time I got them, they were $8.99. And it's the bag that I used last time. So, I guess we, I'm going to get two of, two of these because the other ones over there are already uh, peeled. So, let's go over here and get more food for them. Okay, so back to the uh, hold ones that's already been peeled. We're going to get, I guess, two pounds of these here and organic raw pumpkin seeds. Probably two pounds of those. Oh, they've been getting them. All right, stay tuned. I hope this ain't copyrighted music in her, y'all. I'm going to be pissed. Y'all make sure y'all thumbs up. Almost two pounds. Add a little more. Okay, let's check it again, babe. Okay, it's a little bit before two pounds, which that's good. And they actually do enjoy these, y'all. Okay, so this is the last one. And then we'll start using oats and stuff, y'all, when it starts getting cold outside.
Isn't Big Daddy such a good helper? Y'all make sure y'all thumbs up for the good helper. Okay, off to the scale we go. Right on the nose. And that's going to be it for us. And we're going to head to check out. So, we got our sunflower seeds raw. They really like those. The peeled sunflower seeds. I think I'm going to plant some of these, y'all. Got some green split peas for them. And these for your girl. Don't y'all know these $5.99? But let's hope they real organic, y'all. Because I'm keeping the seeds so I can have my own cherry plum. And then we have our pumpkin seeds. And this is why our girls laid a month and a half. Right, babe? Yep. So, you guys stay tuned. We're going to head on to check out. And we're going to get it back home and get it all mixed in. All right, y'all. So, we couldn't resist the seasoned uh, chicken wings. So, we're just going to do two pounds of each one. And probably uh, a couple of those skewers. And throw them suckers on the grill. And to the checkout, we go. Oh. Okay, family. So, now uh, I'm going to mix their food. I normally buy just enough for a five gallon uh, bucket, which is what they eat out of. But I got this um, 32 gallon garbage can from uh, Walmart for like $26. So this is what I'm gonna mix their food in. It'll stay in the greenhouse, which is right next to the chicken coop. Look, they coming on in. All right, so we're going to go in with some raw sunflower seeds. Y'all, I just uh, studied real hard and tried some uh, different things and see if they liked it. So the ones they like it the most is the ones that I continue to use. Um, uh, green split peas. And I'm going to save a few of these to, uh, plant. Um, uh, raw pumpkin seeds. Look, she all back there. Um, sunflower seeds already peeled. I don't know if I'm saying this right. Lentils, lentils, L E N T I L S. I heard they really like these. I'm going to save some of these to try to grow. This is my first time trying these. Okay. Believe it or not, it smells so much better than that regular feed. Yeah, 
they oyster shells. I'm gonna have to get they oyster shells and put in her. Okay, and then we're going to start the process all the way over. Y'all give me just a couple of seconds. Let me check on the girls out here because I got them running around in the yard. Got to make sure ain't no hawk going to fly down and get them. So y'all give me a couple of minutes. Now, so these are oyster shells that I use for them. It's like seven dollars a track supply. When I get a chance, you wanna zoom down in there? When I get a chance, I'ma uh, figure out who got a good kind at a cheaper price. But um, this is what we left off at. We got it all in. And then we just wanna mix it around like we did the first layer. They so ready to eat, y'all. And they got some in a five-gallon bucket. But mama's making fresh food. Look, they coming on in. Girl, what are you talking about? Don't come in here. And look, the citrus now. Start the process all over again. Well, I'm wasting some for our feet. Can't put it on the ground, y'all, because they waiting on me to drop something for them. Yeah, it was 100 degrees. The lights been off for a week. Internet been down. FYI, these are the same orchard family. Camera got too hot and cut off. But I saved it for you guys. This is how we get them to lay super early. Plus I get them raisins and stuff for treats. Super tight lid. <laughs> 